All right, man, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Hunter Superstar. We're back with another video today. Today, we're going to be checking out 303 Freestyle, The Problem with Joy City, a video made by Sin Zero. Shout out Sin Zero, man. And make sure you go check out the channel. Go check out the original video. I'm going to have it in a link. In, oh, my God. I'm going to have the link in the description. But, you know, uh, this was like a real short video. We're going to go ahead and get straight into it and see, see what he's talking about. Well, good morning, everybody. So I'm starting to uh, Bro, view this 15. more like a job, <laughs> a volunteer job, since I don't make anything. Uh, I guess my job title would be influencer, uh, which is interesting to me because I'm the type uh, who thinks for myself, and uh, I also preach to others about uh, thinking for themselves, okay, try okay. to break okay. away from the shackles of society. Since my opinion seems to be uh, valued, which is very nice by the way, I can't thank people enough, I'm going to get into some big problems with Joy City, and uh, what you're about to see doesn't really have much to do with the game, but uh, I mean, much to do with what I'm talking about, but uh, I, I needed some kind of footage so I could talk over it. <laughs> And I always knew this uh, company had a lot of problems, but uh, I kept my opinions uh, to the people around me, and now the whole world can know. Uh, this company hasn't gotten any better. In my opinion, they are getting worse, and 2020 That's was facts. the best year facts. for this game. I thought I the $100 wins were bad, but Joy City always seems to outdo uh, themselves with more ways to uh, scam the public. In my opinion, making it where you can uh, make a bit of money by being good at a game has ruined gaming because there's only a handful of people that make money and 95% of the money goes to Joy City. Okay. Basically, what you're saying right now, okay, okay. I understand it, but like, People don't make money from this game. Like, this is not like any other game. Where if you're at the top and you get good, you know, you start playing in actual tournaments and compete for cash prizes. With this game, they don't even go that far. They don't have no esports league. They don't have none of that stuff, bro. Uh, we, we don't, you know, they don't even take it that far. This is not that type of game. Like, which sucks that... People are like competing so like so hard like they, they take it so serious as if they're going to an esports tournament or something and they they got like hundreds to thousands of dollars on the line bro like it's not that serious I mean there are ways you can you can make money off of it of course like what we do YouTube you know Twitch hey even TikTok. <laughs> I just, you know, I just got my first, I got my first diamonds the other day. Somebody actually sent me diamonds, so I made a little bit of money. wasn't nothing crazy, but yeah. I mean, it sucks that they don't have esports, but YouTube and Twitch and you know, all that stuff is the other ways that we can make it. You know, I don't know. let's see what they gotta say, bro. Meanwhile, we all competing to be the best so that w we can find a way to the top of the food chain. Take it from someone like myself who has always been good at the game. <coughs> However, I just enjoy the game and I've never taken it seriously because I know how broken it is. And if I didn't play this game for a long time, I would have stopped a long time ago. Because this game is extremely pay to win and Joy City just keeps getting more greedy as time goes on. They still haven't fixed Fred's jump pass and a lot of other glitches. Instead, facts, they facts. focused on more characters and updates we should have had years ago, like knowing what the odds are for card combos and the uh, and what they did with the food and yeah, a bunch of other things. Yeah, they only wait uh, so this late. This game huh? is still broken, and the only way to make Joy City listen is to is for everybody to stop spending money. I love this game too, but it's getting to the point of insanity. They really need to perfect the gameplay and maybe learn how to spell properly. I guess they are Korean, <laughs> but they definitely have English translators. That sucks. The, the problem is they don't care because it doesn't affect their income. 
they can't even give us an accurate time for when the servers are up and it's always the same old song and dance with Joy City. They apologize for the inconvenience and uh, thank us for our patience. They never learned from their- Bro, bro. That, that apology and compensation don't mean nothing because it's garbage. Like, bro, what am I going to do with 150 points worth of items? They don't give you the points. They give you items that's worth that amount of points. So that's like five small XP drinks, three silver pack tickets. Like, really, bro? <laughs> So the compensation, it, it doesn't mean anything, bro, honestly. They, they think that means something, but it doesn't. I can see how that stuff can help newer players that don't have as much of that stuff. But, like, look at all the players that have been playing, bro. We got, we got hundreds and thousands of XP drinks. Like, if we're being honest, bro, we have way too many. We don't need to keep getting XP drinks. Like, maybe make a system we could sell those or something, bro. We could sell everything we don't need. So, if I want to get rid of all them XP drinks, I could honestly get rid of those. That way, when new character drop, I just I'd sell whatever XP drinks I don't need. And that way, I can, I can open up some 10 packs on them. I can open up some silvers, you feel me? You know, I, I honestly feel like that would be better. Cause like, bro, y'all didn't see how many I got, bro. It's crazy the amount that I have. And there are people way more than me. So, like, that compensation, bro, that doesn't mean anything. It's really not worth it, bro. There are mistakes, though. I've always been hesitant about uh, putting Joy City on blast because why would people listen to me? Given the fact my best video is about how broken this game is, well, <laughs> I guess here we are. I also heard Lambo is a hacker, and if that is true, it makes a lot of PC players suspect. Because I won't say anyone is a hacker without knowing the facts, I will say that if there's one hacker, guaranteed there are others that we don't know about. True. And when it uh, comes true. to rank, they got to um, make the rewards better. Because, um, yeah, they're crap, and there's really no difference between... Um, double S and triple S besides a hundred points a and then if we uh, go into the tournament mode there shit the rewards are way better there it's way less stressful and yeah you're not sitting there grinding for freaking triple S for a couple weeks you know just for what a measly extra hundred points and uh, you know how this game is odds are the hundred points aren't gonna really do anything well also tournament mode is basically just a way for PC players to, to farm points you look at the leaderboards, man. Last time I checked, it was literally all PC players at the top. Uh, they're the ones that's really getting all the points, man. You feel me? Like, nobody else is getting points. Even on the ranked leaderboards, it's all PC right now. Yeah, there, there are a few, a few console players, of course. Like, yeah, PC and console, let's be honest. Those are the only two that's really up there. Xbox, yeah, I don't even need to talk about Xbox, but that was like, like honestly, you know, Joy City did just cap them, they capped the frames, so now we, we kind of on an even playing field, I feel like PlayStation is back on top, how it's supposed to be, you know, since we obviously had it the longest, like PC really only had the advantage because of the frames, bro. They, they seen stuff before we even got to see it. So, like, stuff happened before it happened on our screen, which was crazy. But, I mean, I, I don't know, bro. I don't know. I, there's still a lot of PC players at the top, though. Honestly. It's just new ways for them to come up with PC players to get free rewards or something. I don't know. Maybe they're trying to make everybody transfer to PC and wallet out a PC account. That's what it seemed like to me. Cause look how long it took them to even to even cap the frames, bro. Like that's ridiculous. It took them that long. But yeah. We're gonna see what this game got for in the future, bro. For you, I mean maybe. It is possible, but I mean come on. Uh shit, I thought the intensive notes were bad that they're giving away a while ago, but compared to these freestyle pieces, I mean shit, the intensive notes at least 
that was decent, you know, you could actually like do quite a bit with that, but what freestyle pieces? I mean Agreed. All right. <laughs> oh shit. Like at least we can work on P six and characters with video, intensive though. notes. Uh, like and subscribe if you found this interesting. I might not be a people person, but that doesn't mean I don't have a lot of love for others. I hope everyone has a good day and maybe one day we can uh, start a revolution against Joy City. <laughs> I doubt that's gonna happen. But uh that's that's a good video, bro. I I agree with a lot that you was talking about. I'm gonna check out the other one too, man. I didn't even see that one. So I'm about to check that out, see what you're talking about in the other video. But uh, hey, man, that's going to do it for today's video. Make sure y'all like up the video. Make sure you subscribe. Turn on post notifications. Y'all know we on the grind at 2,000. You feel me? Come on, man. We already super close to 2,000. It's crazy. It really is. But I ain't going to hold y'all too long, man. It's been your boy, Hunter Superstar. We out of here. Peace.